All right, guys. Welcome back to some more of uh, Metal Gear 3. Uh, Snake Eater here. So I think they told us in the last episode we need to... We need to swim this way. direction for him. We go to the Pos Pozovi West or whatever the fuck it is. Another bleep bleep. How do we climb up here? Okay. How do we pick these guys up again? There's a way we... How do we pick these guys up again? I feel like... How do we pick them up again, man? I swear there was a way we could pick these guys up here. Oh. What's that? They do drop something here. SVD sniper rifle using L1. Uh, oh, huh. okay. We got a sniper rifle. Finally, finally, finally. Buddy, you got anything for us? Okay, let's get out of here then. Oh, I guess if we didn't come this way, we'd have no sniper rifle. But like the sniper rifle would be quite useful for us as well. Here we go. Can't we swim here, my friend? I got encroaching. Okay, we'll go this way then. The warehouse exterior. So be it. Hmm. Got a cutscene here. Let's see what's good here. Huh? 
Oh, we could have looked. Oh, there's the man is. Get your hands off me. Sokolov, I think his name was. I'm not Sokolov. Going of course, why? Why you gotta do this to us sometimes? Really now? How many times must I tell you? <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, that was a girl who was like uh, his daughter or something. Each time you resist, your lover will suffer the consequences. Oh, his uh, never mind, his lover. Vulcan. Vulcan. Damn you! Vulcan guys reminds me of someone. Touching her breast like that. Oh. Uh. Hold it right there, traitor. Oh. Ocelot. Let's find out just how lucky you are. Watch closely. One of these three guns has a single bullet in it. I'm going to pull the trigger six times in a row. Are you ready? I still got some skills, my man. Could be a juggler in a circus. He can piss his pants. Huh. Looks like your luck hasn't run out yet. So far as Volgan just let him. Oh. There's no such thing as luck on the battlefield. <laughs> You'd better stay in line from now on. Or the else. Cobras will take care of him. This is probably why Ocelot joins Big Boss here. Oh. There's the CIA dog been disposed of yet? Morgan story. The pain is dead. Pain is dead. What? Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Relax. I gotta bring down the whole damn building. I'm sure you got some good points. He may be a child. Though. But he's definitely one of yours. Straight sure here. <clears throat> what? I fear Khrushchev may have a hand in this. We have no time to lose. You must eliminate him before the final test. Don't worry. Oh, she feels They'll a bit be able bad. to handle it. Who's they? What the hell is this one? I'm leaving him to you, the fear. Oh. oh okay. The old man is always sleeping. Is he all right? 
The end is saving what life he has left in him for battle. Normally, he's dead. But he'll wake up when the time is right. And when he does, it will be the end for the boy. Oh, okay. Yeah. Sokolov isn't worth your love. You can entertain me until the rain stops. Oh. Kuwabara, Kuwabara. Uh. Kuwabara, Kuwabara. No oh, idea what that means. The fear and the end. So we dealt with the pain. We got the fear. And then we got Pizarro, the... Is that you? Well, we... Our camera... Like, man, this controller dies too quick on the PlayStation 3. <clears throat> it's gonna hit the R1. Kurobaru, is that you? Is that what she asked? Maybe it is us. Um, let's call Major Zero here. Major, Sokolov's been hauled off. Yes, they probably caught him trying to escape from the lab. Didn't Volgin say that they still needed to perform the final test? Yeah. Then Sokolov must have been taken back to the lab. Get to the lab and get Sokolov the hell out of there. Pass through that warehouse and you'll come out south of the lab. Make your way inside the warehouse. Watch out for enemy sentries. Okay, um... Sounds hmm. like the Cobra Unit's members' names came from the specific emotions they each carry into battle. Emotions? Yeah. For unbearable torment, the pain. For true oblivion, the end. For infinite rage, the fury. For absolute terror, the fear. Oh. And for unsurpassed bliss, the joy. The joy? It's another hey. name for the boss. Because of the joy she feels in battle, I suppose. Oh, uh, the, the fury is the, the guy war, with the lightning. she had a partner named the Sorrow. Sorrow and Joy. They say there couldn't have been a more perfect pair. All right, let's see. Ava, Ava. Response, our girl is out of order here. The end, bro. We got like, what kind of boss? Um. So where's our sniper here? SVD. My man is. What in the fuck? Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, that was. The early end. Oh, wow. look at that. We got him. Let's see, it was. What kind of boss battle was that? She said he was gonna end us. The fucking easiest boss battle we had all game. They didn't even tell us, eh? Fucking assholes. Tell them. The enemy was here. Yeah, because they didn't... They, they, fucking, they didn't even tell us about this. Yo, we're very proud of our accomplishments there. Okay, we finally shut them the fuck up over there. Ah, yeah, man, that was a pretty interesting boss battle there, to be honest. I don't know what the fuck happened there. We just saw the sniper. We took it out. Took him out. Really not much of a problem, eh? She made it seem like this guy was going to be impossible to kill or some shit. But... Ah, my G, he was not. Whoa, 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 whoa.
Same here. Oh no, we go in this way, I think. Something, something, something. Oh, electronic amplifier dim light allows you to see in the dark. Okay. Days. I'm gonna get back up here. Right, I think we're good from here. This guy's, uh, um, I'll sleep here so we can go on the warehouse. Looking good here, fam. We're looking pretty good. Disinfection. Base and desert. Bandages. Alright, we can use that. Alright, I think we're good. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go save Sokolov. We fucking dealt with your bitch boy. In the end. So far, if I can, the pain was a was a bit of a brutal fight, man. Um, all right, we got some thermal goggles. What was that other thing we picked up? That's. Oh, look at all this stuff. Um, what was it that we picked up in this item area? Life medicine, night vision goggles. Okay, we got a, uh, got a, uh, the fuck is life medicine? Um, yes, motion detector, anti personnel. I don't know what the difference between night vision and thermal is, to be honest. Well, night vision, we get some clearer views, right? Thermal, we get to see kind of like more thermal activity going down here. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, showing us a lot of stuff going down here. What the hell do we... Oh, this guy, holy shit. Oh, fucking thermal. Oh. 
Oh, can we jump over this? Oh, look at that. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> can we go up? We can. What's up there? Oh, there's a big snake up there. Look at that thing. Let's take the thermals off, bro. Wait, where the hell? Oh, a little rabbit there, my man. Let's eat something here. Let's eat a rat. This is rotten. Oh no. Maybe this one's rotten too. Ugh, rotten. Oh, we got a stomach echo. We got to cure you. Um, how are we going to cure you? Serum? No, that's poisoning. Okay, my stomach. okay there you go. Okay, what way are we supposed to even go here? Where, where's our, where's our entrance, bro? Oh, oh. Okay, we got a call. <clears throat> Snake, have you been caught in a snare trap? We yeah. have. If you don't get down from there soon, the enemy might spot you. I know that. Then why don't you get yourself down? How am I supposed to do that? It should be obvious. If you get caught in a snare trap, press the action button. That will allow you to cut the rope. Hurry and free yourself before the enemy comes around. Okay. Bro. Oh, the action button, okay. I'm assuming. Okay, we're in the outside walls. Granny Gork Lab. Oh. Yeah, we need our uh, need our night vision thermal goggles on here. That fan. We got this. Electricity.
Okay, just a second. Okay. Let us snake him. Bro, we'll eat him. Python, we'll eat him. Eat that mofo. Okay. Groki lab, exterior, inside walls. Alright, let's go. Uh, I see you've one. made it inside the outer wall. Sokolov is inside the lab. Look for a way in and use it to infiltrate the lab. All right. Sounds like the Cobra unit's members' names came from the specific emotions they eat. Oh, we already saw this. Oh. Major Zero. Sokolov is inside the lab. Look for a way to infiltrate the lab. Okay. Well, we might need our night vision. Okay. We managed to let that one work, but I'm not too sure how long we're gonna gonna get lucky like that, to be honest. These thermal visions are, are very useful for us right now. Anything in the end over here? Any wars we got, smoke grenades we got. What do we got in here? Oh, okay, never mind. We go inside here. That's why we get inside. Granny Gorky Labs. Base Oyoma. Get inside. Let's get inside. Can they see us through those windows there? Oh 
Maybe we should pull out our gun. So if this mofo's in here, he's definitely not just chilling over here. Okay, what, what do we have here? Spray gun. Spray gun? Okay. Hold on a second, though. Can't we camouflage our scientists? Oh, what is this? That's a desert. Yeah, we can. Look at this. Um. Help! Help, help, help! We're innocent here, folks. Look at this. Uh, and okay. Okay, this might be just like kind of like distracting enemies, I believe. What is this here? Oh! Oh, oh shit. Support units, do not move out. All right, we we killed the stealth part. Where uh, we aren't gonna be doing anything there. Oh, look at my man coming in with the knife. What the hell is? Who the hell is this guy? If you're looking for Sokolov, he's not here anymore. Oh. <laughs> Put that thing away. You'll spoil my drink. Looks like he's an ally? No. Oh, you're the intruder everyone's talking about. Yep. <laughs> Typical <laughs> capitalist dog. No manners. That looks like he's a zombie or something. Doesn't he? I've seen you, some better days. You mean you've never heard of me? Oh. And you call yourself an agent? Very well, then. 
I am Alexander Leonovich Granin. A man of some importance, if I do say so myself. Oh, okay. I am the foremost weapon scientist in the Soviet Union. And the head of the glorious Granin Design Bureau. This is the Order of Lenin. Yeah. It is an honor of the greatest Insect. magnitude, given along with the title of Hero of Socialism to only the finest workers. It was awarded to me in recognition of my brilliant contributions to society. Since the Great Patriotic War, I have created countless weapons in the service of our great communist society. It was thanks to me that we were able to stamp out the Nazi scum. It was I who created the basic design for the mobile ballistic missile system you know and fear as SS-1C. Ah. You're crocked, aren't you? I'm merely drowning my sorrow. Because of him, I've got nothing to do but sit here and drink this crap. Him? Sokolov. It's him you're looking for, isn't it? Because of him, I have been stripped of my authority. My research has come to nothing. Look. It is a revolutionary mobile nuclear missile system. A bipedal tank. A bipedal tank? Yes, a walking tank, a robot. Are you familiar with the theory of the missing link between apes and humans? Well, this technology will be the missing link between infantry and artillery. A kind of metal gear, if you will. And this magnificent metal gear will mark a revolutionary step forward in weapons development. Metal gear? <laughs> but I won't be used so easily, no. No crying myself to sleep. For you see, I'm going to send these documents to my friend in the United States. What? These bastards will live to regret this. And when they themselves become the targets of my creation, they will know my true greatness. Yes, Sokolov's pathetic shagohard pales in comparison to my work. What are you going to do with a rocket engine on a tank? About Sokolov. A tank does not need a rocket. It needs something else. Look at these. Nice shoes. No. Legs. Legs that allow it to go anywhere. Just as when humans learn to walk upright. That is the real revolution in weaponry. Don't you agree? But, the fool's in charge, Joe Sokolov. And where is Sokolov? My project has been terminated. The philosopher's legacy has been handed over to him. What the hell are you talking about? All right, my bad. The philosopher's feeling a little bit of cough, legacy. so. Haven't you heard of the philosophers? I just gotta say, my voice is not the greatest. The colonel has inherited their immense legacy. Mm -hmm. Olgin's father was in charge of the philosophers' money laundering activities. Philosophers. In the confusion of the war, a lot of these things, eh? Somehow ended up with their treasure. And Volgin inherited that treasure illegally. We never need to worry about the military budget. The development costs at our facility are all paid out of the Colonel's deep pockets. The weapons born here will be the genes for creating an entirely new form of warfare. The funding for my research came out of that legacy. Came out of it. Now, 
my money, my men, all have been diverted to the Shagohan project. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow they will be conducting the final test, while Sokolov is making the final preparations in the weapons factory at Volgin's main base, the great fortress of Grozny Grad. Here I am, playing host to an enemy spy and drinking myself into a stupor. That's <laughs> where they move Sokolov. Yes. Uh. And the Shagohot is there too. Of course. Hey, <clears throat> you're not thinking of going to Grozny Grad. Are you mad? It's an impenetrable fortress. I'm sure it is. You'll be killed. I'll take my chances. Wait. What? Listen to me, you fool. I want to help you. Oh, okay. help me. To thank you for your compliment. <laughs> what compliment? My shoes. Oh. Tatiana gave them to me. I wanted to thank you for complimenting me on them. Tatiana. I'll tell you how to get into the fortress. Oh. What a nice In guy. Return, I ask only that you get that idiot out of there and destroy the Shagohard. We'll there do is that. An underground tunnel that runs around the perimeter of the fortress. You should be able to use it to sneak into the base. Head for the mountains. The entrance to the tunnel is located there. Take this. Interesting. You passed through a warehouse on your way here. Yeah. Didn't you? Give okay, yeah. this. There should have been a locked door inside of it. Do you remember it? Uh this key will open that door. Oh, is it that one or is it the one that they Beyond tried? That door lies the vast jungle. Lies a vast jungle. You can climb up into the mountains from the far end of the jungle. Go back to the warehouse. Oh, maybe that's the one. Use the key to open the locked door and head for the mountains. Got it? Why are you helping me? Unlike Sokolov, the thought of defecting <clears throat> has never once crossed my mind. I love my country. I love this land. I cannot even imagine living anywhere else. I wish to remain a hero of the great motherland. I cannot bear the thought of being hounded into a corner and left to waste away. It is already dawn. We must hurry. I will remain here and nurse my troubles for a little longer. Oh. To capitalism! <laughs> it assumed they, they had something to listen into him, right? Like they would know if he's like betraying them or not. But it makes sense. Um, let's see what Major Zero says. Major, Sokolov's already been moved to the fortress. But that's only what Granin told you, right? He may have been giving you false info. No, he wasn't lying. How can you be so sure? Gut feeling. Good enough for me. According to Granin, you should be able to get to the mountains through a passage located deep in the jungle beyond the warehouse. Right. Then if I climb the mountains, there'll be an underground tunnel leading to Groznygrad near the summit. Start out by going back to the warehouse. Use the key you got from Granin to open the door and proceed into the jungle. You remember where the door is, don't you? It's directly north of the door you went in when you came from the aqueduct. Okay. Who are you? Somebody! 
That works too, right? Um, yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to end this one off here because I'm, uh, my voice is a little off. We have to just, we just kind of came out of this place. We kind of got chased, but, uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, we'll end this one off here and, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. <laughs>